Do you think that boys in our society are in need of a concrete transition to manhood, like a modern-day initiation ritual? It probably doesn't matter whether they're in need of it. They're not going to get it, because you can't really just invent something like that, right? It has to be... It's something that evolves over a very long period of time. I do think that what they need, and I've really observed this, interestingly enough, in the response that young men have had to my public talks, and probably on YouTube as well, with regards to what I've been saying, because... You know, young people have been fed this pablum since the 1960s that the pathway to happiness and freedom in life, first of all, that those are the things that you're really supposed to be after, especially happiness, and that they're to be found in in like rights and untrammeled freedom. And that's complete. Uh, that's completely one-sided because for every right, there is a corresponding responsibility. And freedom can be chaos just as much as it can be, um, you know, blissful lack of responsibility and the ability to make hedonic choices one after another. Now, I've been speaking to young men in particular, and they're the ones who keep coming to my talks, by the way, about truth in action and responsibility. And like they're eating that up. It's there. I can see their eyes light up, which is so cool. I, I've been talking to the people who ran for the conservative leadership in Canada um, about the fact that when I go talk to male audiences, especially young men, that they're unbelievably enthralled by any discussion of genuine responsibility and truth. And so the conservatives have something to offer young men. And I would say that's roughly akin to an initiation. You know, the idea is that at some point you have to tell young men, look, grow the hell up, take on some responsibility, straighten yourself out, uh, act honestly, make yourself into an, an admirable and powerful character. Not because you're um, domesticated like a bloody puppy or a sheep, but because that's the way to genuine authority and influence and and the capacity to do great good in the world and that's like an exciting call to adventure and i think that that's a modern sophisticated intellectual equivalent to something like an initiation ritual and so i hope to be like promoting that message more and more i i was speaking to member of uh like a, one of the leaders of the indigenous communities in canada today about maybe getting the high school version of the future authoring program that future authoring program i've talked about that a bit before on patreon you know it's a program at selfauthoring.com that enables people to generate a vision for their lives and also to uh, and to detail out that vision and make a plan of it i think most of you patreon subscribers have got links to that already and usernames and passwords and has a really remarkably positive effect on young men who are disenfranchised who tend to be ethnic minorities and so initiating them into the idea that they need to take control of their own destiny and that that's the proper pathway to authority and stature and and not self-esteem but self-respect which is a completely different thing i think is a reasonable modern equivalent to initiation ritual <laughs>